I am going to play this for the benefit of those. Anybody from any country who would think that when they go as tourists, especially in Jamaica, that they must show abuse or prejudice in any way towards those people who are working at the hotels as if them is just less than human. This is what happened in an incident in a Jamaican hotel wherein a black American woman threw her drink in the face of a Jamaican woman hotel worker thinking that the person whom she threw assaulted by throwing her drinks in the person's face, this woman was gonna just take it and be and feel dehumanized and disrespected. So what this girl is saying now, I Rascado fully agree. For nobody should see them go down there in Jamaica and them try to have a feeling like since them are going to spend money down there at hotels that is owned by maybe some American billionaire or some other country's billionaire, millionaire, wealthy people down there who in league with Jamaica for make money off of tourism. And you cannot go to other people's country and try to abuse them and disrespect them. Most Jamaicans now got tolerated. And me I tell you this. I am going to show this and put it on certain sites. And I will see which one of them sites over here is prejudicial towards this girl who is speaking the truth with regards to how them like to dehumanize, especially black people. We might be poor in Jamaica, you know. And our skin is black. But don't ever make the mistake to disrespecting us in any way, farm or shape. Listen to what this lady uh, I say. And for owner protection, don't go anywhere to any country and disrespect the workers them. Hotel workers and otherwise. I agree with what this girl saying. Listen. Alright, now some of them might not want to listen to this you now. But this is truth. Uno can go to Jamaica. I think so uno want to beat up other people down there. It not go work. Watch this. Uno left it America would uno. Where I now come from, wherever I'm not even talk about the Kenyan people because uno black Americans, uno are the one that come to Jamaica and they feel like uno must disrespect people any kind of way. Uno must absolve people and they feel like say uno going to walk away with it. Anytime uno black Americans, uno with the nasty attitude or whatever uno want to do, uno come to Jamaica. I'm going to make a sad mistake because I'm going to get to the rasper. Perfect example of this what happened at the real hotel. And I hope the real don't fire this girl. She was defending herself. The lady that on her work, and I do her work. Who is you, girl? Who is you, girl, to come take water through in her face? Who is you, girl? You and your friend, and you cannot fight. And you cannot fight, and you come to Jamaica, and you trouble people. How do you come to Jamaica, come to trouble people, and you cannot fight? Make it make sense to me, me now. That's why the barefoot lady says she don't want to know her place. And when the barefoot lady did talk, who would have been a in other fields? No one to see. Very true. Because when that woman expressed herself and taught the truth, because them come off your place, come basically mash it up. And she talk. And them a go against the woman, you know. They, them go down there and think that them can't treat Jamaicans any kind of nasty attitude we and we must just sop it up and not say nothing. Talk, girl. I feel like we can't come back to America or Yankee or wherever we want to be. We don't let America come down there with the same attitude and do America or no ass. I'm going to get popped. The only thing we want to do is to say I two hands and fling off our body. 
Or two of them fling off her body, the one that the green bad suit, and we still land somewhere over there, so she not fear get up yet. No foot, no feel left past she. On the altar order. On the altar order, I mean, any hotel worker, one of the hotel workers, any guest assault, you know, throw nothing power, you know, and put and power, you know, fix them business and defend themselves. If you don't have to walk off, you don't walk off. I mean, I want to eat for nine days, call for this, because I see everybody a try to support, support the young lady who was abused by the guest. Yeah, because you said that the hotel owners, them probably is American people and them no want the truth to come out. But we Jamaicans have to speak truth and defend truth seriously anywhere upon the planet we are. Speak, girl. Ask them guests to leave. Me want to know if you know we ask them guests to leave because what Uno should have done as me expected guests come and assaulted a worker employer but I want Uno employ but I want to know if Uno did ask the guests to leave I want to ask the girl to leave because Uno, uno, uno hotel people Uno, uno hotel managers and Uno hotel Uno act like I said Uno feel like sending guests to another human being they want to come and work and guests because of money and Uno want a good name and Uno want to know the name in the media Uno feel like the guests are going to do anything very true, girl. Tell them, Jamaican woman. Tell them. Tell them. And them can go and say what they want to say. But, you know, we not, can't do no violence, you know. But she assaulted the woman first. She threw the first blow. And what the woman should I say? She should have said, boy, because I'm a job, me I go just make the woman throw things to my face and disrespect me. No! Anywhere on the planet that we are, people must defend themselves. Even be ready for suffer any consequences. Job or not, we must go through because Ja is with us. Talk, girl. The people escape with the number of people then I go pop and me say, I commend this girl, I commend this girl, goody. You angle yourself well, pop them ras. You should have still have pop them ras. Pop them ras, pop everything upon them. Out of order. This is why me say, when the barefoot woman said, you know, black Americans, you know, come up people place, you know, damage it, you know, destroy it, you know, attitude sink, you know, you know, the decks. Now look at you know, you know, you know, ras, you get pop. You know, come down here with the dress you have to you know, you know, bumble. Yeah, man, you have to tell them straight, you know. You have to tell them straight. Rastafari, I know.